Megxit in shock. UK Parliament approves King Charles' decision to transfer Sussex title to Lady Louise. You're wrong. Canada PM refutes Harry and Meghan's request for security during Invictus Games. Harry and Meghan, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, suffered the biggest blow to their royal status when King Charles decided to transfer the title to his niece, Lady Louise Windsor, with the approval of the British Parliament. The move announced on Friday comes after months of tension and controversy between the Sussexes and the rest of the royal family following their decision to step back as senior royals in 2020 and move to California, where they're pursuing lucrative deals with Netflix, Spotify, and other media agencies. The monarch, who is undergoing treatment for cancer, is said to have made the decision to strip Harry and Meghan of their titles after consulting with his mother, who remains head of state before her passing. According to a statement from Buckingham Palace, the king feels that the Sussexes have reached the terms of the agreement that they made when they left the royal family by continuing to use royal titles and royal rules on their new website, Sussex.com. No mention of the Windsor family or the monarchy, though. The statement said the king took this decision with the support of Princess Diana and the Prince of Wales to protect the dignity and integrity of the crown and royal family. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex have been informed of this decision and have been asked to stop using their titles and coat of arms immediately. The statement also said the king had decided to bestow the titles of Duke and Duchess of Sussex on his niece, Lady Louise Windsor, eldest child of Prince Edward and the Earl and Countess of Wessex. Lady Louise is 21 and studying at Edinburgh University, 15th in line to the throne, and is praised for her modest and reserved approach to royal life. The statement said the king is pleased to announce that he has confirmed the titles of Duke and Duchess of Sussex onto his niece, Lady Louise Windsor, with the consent of Parliament. The king believes that Lady Louise is a worthy, very worthy recipient of this title, as she has shown great loyalty, respect, and service to the crown within the royal family. The king hoped this title would bring joy and honor to Lady Louise and her future husband, whoever he may be. This decision has met many mixed reactions from the public and the media. Some applauded the king for taking a tough stance against the Sussexes, who were accused of disrespecting and damaging the monarchy with constant criticism and complaints, and others who sympathized with Harry and Meghan, who have claimed to be victims of racism, bullying, and harassment from the British press and the royal establishment. The decision also sparked outrage and dismay from supporters and fans of the Sussexes, who accused the king of being cruel, unfair, and vindictive towards Harry and Meghan, who faced countless challenges and difficulties since leaving the royal family, such as lawsuits, death threats, and family threats. The Sussexes are yet to comment on the decision, but sources close to them say they are shocked, saddened, and angry by the king's actions, and that they felt betrayed and abandoned by their own family. Sources also said the Sussexes have no intention of giving up their title, and they will continue to fight for their rights and freedoms. Sources say Harry and Meghan are devastated by the decision, which they see as a personal attack and a punishment for speaking the truth and living their lives. They've worked hard to build their brand and platform, and they won't let anyone take that away from them. They're proud of their titles and everything they've done. They will not bow to the king's demands. They are ready to take legal action if necessary, and they have the support of millions of people around the world who love them.